after a steep decline during the pandemic, the number of immigrants who have become U.S. citizens reached a recent high in the past year. Let's take a look by the numbers. Nearly 970,000 immigrants became citizens during the 2022 fiscal year, as officials caught up on a backlog of pandemic applications. That's the most in nearly 15 years when more than a million became citizens and the third highest amount ever, according to an analysis by the Pew Research Center. Some 670,000 naturalization applications were still pending last year year, according to Pew. That's down from more than a million in December 2020 when the pandemic suspension of interviews and naturalization ceremonies, as well as funding issues, contributed to the major backlog. The top five countries where the most new citizens came from last year were Cuba, the Philippines, India, Mexico, and the Dominican Republic, according to a report from the U.S. Citizenship and Immigration Services. The ranks of naturalized U.S. citizens has nearly tripled from 7.6 million to 22.1 million between 1995 and 2019. Some 9 million immigrants remain legal permanent residents who could be eligible for citizenship, meaning they've been in the U.S. for at least five years or three years if married to a U.S. citizen. They must also pass background checks and pass a civics and English text as part of the interview process. Immigrants also pay some $725 in government fees to apply and often pay thousands more for the costs of a lawyer to help navigate the process. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.